guys what's up it's your girls here and welcome back to my channel so please don't mind my appearance and i feel like i say that every time i come up on here but for real this time don't mind it because we're going to do a little maintenance monday today is monday actually the monday before valentine's day so it's a little self-love spa day if you want to call it and i'm very happy to have one here today because i'm going to be sharing some new goodies that were sent to me by oloplex as well as i envy they sent me a box full of lashes they actually have me as one of their ambassadors now which i'm so excited about so today is going to be a hair care face mask press on nails we're going to do some eyelashes the whole shebang because i'm bare i'm looking rough i need help if you guys want to come along with me and see some of the goodies that were sent to me and see how i do my little at home self-care treatments and then continue to keep on watching okay so i just wanted to start by showing you this huge box that oloplex was so kind to send me full of their entire line of goodies oh my goodness i'm feeling spoiled right now i have never tried oloplex products before but i've heard a lot of mixed reviews about it and if i'm being 100 percent honest with you I don't really know too many curly girls talking about this product, so I want to give it a go and see how it works for my hair. Something that I know about Olaplex products is that it helps to restore the bonds of your hair. So just like we all have different hair types, we all have the same bond structure, and this really helps to go inside of our hair strand and restore it so that it's more manageable, more hydrated, smooth, and protected. We have all different types of damages like environmental damage, heat damage, pollution damage, and this particular line helps to protect and restore from it all. So I'm very stoked. My hair has been feeling very dry. This West Coast weather, dry heat, dry air. I miss the humidity. These curls miss the moisture. <laughs> I think the products that I'm going to be checking out today and using is going to be their number three, which is one of their number one sellers, and number eight. This is an intense moisture mask. So number three is a reparative strengthener. And yeah, I think I'm going to use zero two. Learn together, so <laughs> bear with me. Before I go ahead and start with those um, products, I do want to just go through a couple of other things that they sent me that I'm probably going to try out. Some of the things I might gift away, but I'm just very grateful that they sent this to me, and I just want to share it with you guys. So if you guys ever tried Olaplex products, definitely leave some comments below what your thoughts and opinions are, if it worked for you, if it didn't. Are you a curly girl and trying it out for the first time like me? Let me know. <laughs> my hair, I haven't washed it probably in like four days. Four or five days? Yeah, something like that. And I use a lot of like hydrating creams, mousses, and gels and stuff like that. So it's feeling very gunky. and ugh. But it's also very dry at the same time. So we're going to see how this works. Let's go down the line. So we have number zero. So this is like a primer spray, right? This is going to help to intensely restore the bonds and it's usually paired with number three so i'm actually going to wet my hair with this first and then put number three on and then after we leave this one for like 10 minutes i'm going to go ahead and wash it out and because like i said my hair is feeling gunky i'm going to try to use their clarifying shampoo it says that it deep cleans softens restores shines and clarity and it's for all hair types okay they have the regular number four and number five which is their original hydrating shampoo this is going to be great for daily washes i'm going to definitely be using the number eight intense moisture mask today so after i wash with my clarifying i'm going to be putting this guy on something i do know about these two is that number three is not going to give you hydration this is just restoring the bonds of the hair so it's great to pair it with number eight so that you can get that deep conditioning moisture mask that you're looking for also sent me their number nine which is a um, bond protecting nourishing serum this has heat protection up to 450 degrees it helps to detangle and it has style memory in it so my day two day three hair is still gonna be looking popping so I'll leave in styler which I may not do this one today but we're gonna save this for like you know a future tryout because like TikTok has been asking me how like, I style my hair normally so I'm gonna use my um, TGIN products and just style normally but they also sent me their bonding oil I've heard so many great things about it it is a very tiny guy and has heat protection helps to soften detangle it uh, reduces frizz and flyaways extend color and vibrancy all the great things i love that last but not least they also launched a new dry shampoo i have short hair i don't really use dry shampoo i have volume because of my curls 
and I never really felt the need to use it. Even when my hair was longer and straight, I don't know why I never really used it. If anything, I was always putting oils in my hair to help tame that frizziness. But if you have oily hair and you want to prolong your straight hair or your blowouts and things like that, this is going to be a little hidden gem here. Also, I've heard that there's antioxidants in this to help your hair from pollution damage. I'm going to start with zero and it says to apply this slowly to dry hair. The hair should be damped, not drenched, and leave it on for 10 minutes. For best results, apply number three perfector, which is this little guy here, and comb it through. Let process for a minimum of 10 minutes. So I'm assuming it's 20 minutes together, like 10 minutes and then another 10 minutes. And then after I wash everything out, this is going to be for another 10 minutes. So this is going to be a 30 minute treatment. This is a whole process. Okay. <laughs> We're going to do this though. I mean, this was already like spilling when I was trying to take the plastic off, but yeah, we're going to do this. Like I said, this is like a primer. I don't know if I kind of like that smell, but yeah, we're gonna. It says not really focusing it on the um, the roots, more so the ends. I don't like that smell. Mm. But in my scalp, oh my god, my scalp is so itchy though. Like, I can't wait to wash already. But, I'm gonna take this comb and just comb it through. Yeah. My hair has gotten so long. I don't know what to do with it, you guys. I don't know if I should cut it, let it grow, or what. I do love my hair short, but I kind of like the length that it's at because I can kind of do braids a little bit more easily. And like, I think it's long enough to get on a ponytail. I saw this girl on my Instagram slaying some ponytails and i wanted to slick back and i told Jaden, he was just like i bet you were gonna cut your hair and shave it and like da -da -da. and i'm just like listen sir i go through phases anybody else go through those phases like one day you want short hair one day you just want hair down in your booty cheeks i'm sorry oh i like that picasso okay this one i'm excited about I was told that one of these are sold in like every three seconds around the world. This is supposed to be a life-changing product. Finger it through first, then we're gonna comb it through. It feels nice on my hair and it smells so good. This one smells good. That first one was questionable. I was like, what? Not a good start. <laughs> but like I said, it's not really like for the benefits of smelling good deep conditioning it's supposed to repair and strengthen my hair so i'm like all right let's try to see past all that scent oh my hair feels so soft okay. you're not gonna go down huh okay that's what i thought shit <laughs> i'm gonna leave this on for 10 minutes and i'm gonna go ahead and wash my face and do a quick little exfoliation and face mask. I'm using my Dermalogica and the Clarity face mask. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and some pre-cleanse here and just do a quick double cleanse. My hands are freezing. Oh my gosh. Yeah, my skin is hella dehydrated. Face, give myself like a face massage. And time to go in with the second cleanse. This is clearing skin wash. This is great if you have oily, acne skin. I get some water. Some exfoliant. This is a daily microfoliant. Holy freaking grail. A little bit of powder, a little bit of water. Look at that glow, look at that. Mm. Mm. We're going to do some extractions off camera and then we'll come back on and put a face mask on. I have oily combination skin, if you guys were curious, and I just get like a lot of congestion and like gunk in my pores. This is 
a Mediterranean Dead Sea mud mask. And it's going to help pull out any impurities, help prevent my breakouts, because I get some crazy hormonal breakouts and super oily in my T-zone. So I love to do this. And it feels very cooling on the skin. Oh snap, don't get it in your eyeball. <laughs> hormonal breakouts all under here because I get hair and I try to remove the hair and then I get like these ingrowns and just it's a never-ending cycle of frustration being a woman I swear like why do we have to get chin hairs and hairs just unwanted spots on our bodies I don't know I'll leave this on for like 10 minutes then I'm having a shower and I'm gonna wash my hair so your girl is fresh out this shower feeling amazing I do have the intense mask in and i'm just letting it sit on my hair for the 10 minutes like it says and in the meantime i went ahead and put on my cute little shein set i love it it's got this cute little robe with the little bralette matching shorts love the lace detailing shein lingerie do not sleep on it okay it's got your girl feeling sexy clarifying shampoo it does its job it had stripped my hair like i know it says it's not supposed to be stripping but my hair was even drier and i'm not certain if like the combination of like the treatment and then the clarify i don't know if i was supposed to do it like that i don't know if i was supposed to do the number three clarify shampoo it out or not i don't know but my hair needed the moisture and this did it for me it smells so good it felt like like cool whip in my hands too it didn't come out like you know very foamy or anything but it was just like very like whippy so I'm about to go ahead and rinse this out and then we're going to get into finishing up my skincare and putting on these eyelashes. Now that the mask is rinsed out, I will be 100% honest with you, my hair does not feel as hydrated as I want it to. But it's okay because we're going to go ahead and add some moisture back into it. But I'm just sitting here thinking to myself like, I just did. 30 minutes worth of a treatment now mind you the first two steps i understand wasn't supposed to add the hydration but that last intensive moisture mask that number eight once i rinsed it out i'm just like my hair is still feeling dry now my curls on the other hand the curls look great i don't know we're just gonna go ahead and style it though we're gonna go ahead and style it the curls are defined, but it's not feeling hydrated like I wanted to. Just the conditioner, but like, I've had conditioners that I washed out and like, they just left my curls feeling softer. I feel like for a damn fact, they are more defined. Like the springiness, everything is beautiful. But I'm looking for the feeling hydration and I'm not really getting that and I'm kind of sad faced about that. getting back into my skincare we're going to go into toner this is the antioxidant hydro mist and i'm going to take a little bit of the glow recipe watermelon pha bha pore type toner that is a lot to say but y'all get the gist i love this stuff though because hydration is everything Mm. It smells like watermelon. Put some on my neck. My cats are trying to be creeps. They coming in. Mm. Put me use some skin hydrating booster. Because my skin is dehydrated but oily. And this is what I use to get such a beautiful glow, but it's literally like adding a glass of water to your skin. Getting those serums in. Laneige eye cream. I'm running out of this. Look how empty. It, it's pretty much gone. But I love this stuff. This is the water bank 
It's a gel eye cream. La Roche Posay for the moisturizer. You just hear a crash and I'm just like, what could that be? Oh my god. Mm. Anybody want some animals? <laughs> I'm just trying to have a spa day. Laneige lip mask. All right, skin. Check. Okay, so now that I'm in different lighting, the hair is giving. The curls are tight and defined and feeling soft. So I was sent this wonderful box from IMV, full of lashes. Mind you, they had made me part of their ambassador program, um, I wanna say probably like four months back. It's been a while, and they've sent me a couple other boxes before, and every single time, they don't miss. Like, they come with all the lashes, all different styles, and I'm just like, oh my goodness, I can't wait to play, I can't wait to use them with my clients, I can't wait to play with them myself. Um, I actually wore these in a couple pictures, I'm gonna insert it, I have it um, on my Instagram, but these colorful lashes, do you see the pink and black tones? They're so pretty, and I can't wait to try out these blue ones. Packs and packs of lashes, you guys. Like, so beautiful. These are like the fluffy, natural wave effect. The slim, thick lashes. Gorge. They even sent me some individual lashes. Like the faux mink, the luxe ones. I was like... I've never seen these before, but these look really, really cool. These are kind of scary. I'm not even gonna lie. I don't know, but they're kind of like clusters, so I'm assuming that like I could create like my own strip. They got some more, some more of these guys. Super, super exciting. Of course, wrote me a little note. It says, we're so excited for you to try out some of our products. We hope you enjoy them and find use in all of your future adventures. Showing off your I Envy lash makeup looks by tagging I Envy by Kiss on your Instagram post and you just might get featured on our page. Thank you for all your continued love and support, the I Envy team. Thank you for always hooking your girl up with the cutest lashes. Look at these, these are so pretty. The fluffy curls. They are really taking it to the next level with these colored lashes. I swear these are perfect for Valentine's Day. But once again, thank you so much, I Envy, for sending me that box full of amazing lashes and continuing keeping your girl stocked up. I am so excited to try these out. These are the V Lux extensions. So it's kind of like DIY salon lash extension application. It has a brush on bond, and then you place the clusters, and then you seal it with a little sealer on the other side. See how these work. I'm a little nervous, I'm not even gonna lie. Anything that's like going close to my eye, like and I've never really tried it before, I get a little nervous. But I hope they look cute. Cause I need some lashes. So this is what comes in the package. If you guys watched my previous IMD video, <laughs> it didn't come with the glue. But obviously this is at home eyelash extension, so it's gotta come with like some type of bonding. But they heard me loud and clear, <laughs> and they hooked your girl up. So we got these cute little gold tweezers, and then we have the lash clusters. Okay, so it says apply a light layer of the bond to the natural lashes, and that a little bit goes a long way. And then take from the center of here, so I'm grabbing the center lashes. And then it says apply from underneath. Wow, that was, that was really easy. Okay, we're gonna go to the next one. And to grab the outer one. And put on the outer comb. Like we're almost done this eye. And this looks so cute already. <laughs> Keep doing it. Fudging up. I'm fudging up. Ah. 
Do you <laughs> Do you see this? They're so comfortable and it doesn't hurt. I don't feel any burning, nothing. Like, this is cute. I'm gonna do the other lash and I'm gonna come back on. Okay, and I'm back with a whole new set of lashes. Honestly, getting eyelash extensions would've took me like two hours. This took me like 20 minutes, not even. So, now we're just gonna go ahead and seal the deal with the other side. So the bond was on one side and the seal's on the other. And it says to just go ahead and put this underneath. Honestly, the easiest lash application. You just put the bond on, pop them on real quick, seal the deal, and then we're done. I love it. Thank you, AMB. Okay, now moving on to nails. Okay, so last but not least, I'm gonna be doing some of these press-on nails from Kiss. This is the acrylic French. I have actually never tried this particular style, but I wanted just like a short little French mani. I figured that these would just be easy. It comes with the glue and extra nails in the back. I'm gonna go ahead and file my nails down and pop these bad boys on. okay you guys so that pretty much wraps up my maintenance monday slash self-care vlog i hope that you and guys enjoyed getting pampered with me today please comment down below what was your favorite part was it the skincare the hair care the nails the dyi lashes honestly between the press ones and the lash extensions these are going to be like my go-to's okay your girl saved a bag and they look bomb okay <laughs> i love them so much and i feel like 110 percent better about myself now that i just like you know did a little self-care and i hope that you take the time out this valentine's day and do the same for yourself i hope that you guys enjoy your valentine's day and you have a safe one and i will see you guys in the next video bye he's being a lover boy right now happy valentine's day my boy He's so handsome, like his eyes are extra blue and like next to my jacket, it's just, it's a vibe. And so as you can see, I don't have no eyelashes on. They're actually right here on my side table. All I gotta say is that if you be princess pillow net, these lashes may work for you. But my lashes were stuck to my forehead this morning, okay? I, my face was in the pillow, not on the pillow. It did not work for me, <laughs> hence why they were on my end table. Um, I don't know if the bond was in place correctly or the sealant didn't seal the job enough, but they didn't work for me. So, I'm bald lashes again. <laughs> me and Whiskey are going to continue to cuddle while I edit. <laughs> wow, look at the service. You're just so handsome. Oh, <laughs> he's just a boy.